we're back with more Tahoe today. Let's check in with the week. He's got the brand new satellite backpack. Who do you have for us right now? Hey, we're still uh, down here in Reno. I break the Reno with one of the managers, Christian. Uh, Christian, thanks for coming on. Thanks for having me. Uh, so tell us a little bit about your role here at Break the Reno. So I'm basically in charge of the daily operations, and part of it would be I'm the game master, so we don't just send you in the room and let you be. I'm checking from the outside from multiple cameras, and I can communicate with walkie-talkies. And I'm basically trying to manage the game, have it, have it a good flow, and get the most out of you. So if you're falling behind, when I see the schedule a little bit, I can give some extra hints, clues to guide you a little bit back. So you can enjoy it the way you should be. Yeah, I was definitely having some trouble. It was a little bit tough for me yesterday, and you definitely uh, were on the talk walkie talkie saying, Louis, look at what's happening. You're horrible at this game. Yeah. Um, tell, tell us a little bit about the benefits of, of coming in and, and playing an escape, uh, an escape and challenging game like this one. I mean, I think just as you realize, it is kind of challenging, so it really pushes you in limits uh, to limits which you usually don't can experience in daily basis. And it really... I mean, for team building exercise, it's just excellent, I think, because it, it really, where you work under pressure, the, the time is ticking down constantly in front of your eyes, and you really want to succeed. You really have to work together properly, because if you don't work, to go, you don't work together, you can really get lost really quickly, and alone, you, even if you're really smart, you're not going to get out. And in that sense, it's, um, it really helps you when the communicate to enhance the communication between each other. And furthermore, you have to think outside the box because you saw that some of those challenges are not straightforward. So you have to think again and again and think behind corners, and then you'll find a way sooner or later. Yeah, it was, it was definitely interesting. And I think it's going to be very interesting for local business owners to bring some of their employees for team bonding activities. But um, when we come back, we'll definitely learn a little bit more about Break the Reno. Back to you, Mike. Alrighty, thank you, Luik. Still sort of struggling on the concept there a little bit, but what I take from it, like a real-life version of Clue, yeah? Yeah, sort of something like that. So, sounds like fun up there in Reno at Breakthrough. We're going to be back with live video and Nate Zelena from Heavenly Mountain Resort. Stay tuned.